What's up you guys? It's Megan and welcome back to my channel and here in the Strange Town series. Before I get into today's episode, I wanted to tell you guys about a Minecraft channel that I'm a part of. It is called The Proper Dummies. The link is at the top of the description. It's where I and friends upload Minecraft content every single day. It's so much fun. So if you guys miss some of the Minecraft on this channel, you guys can always go visit The Proper Dummies to see me play Minecraft there. Now, guys, today... I wanted to send Katie and Glenn on a date ever since the loon came into the picture. It seems that they've just been having trouble just becoming like who they used to be. It seems that they're always fighting now. Last episode, uh, uh, Katie brought home like a chair and a lamp and all this stuff from a yard sale and Glenn was not happy about that at all. He gave her a piece of his mind. So I figured we would send them on a date. However, oh my gosh, why is he like shocked? He's like, oh man, I really have to use the restroom. You guys are dating. Why don't you just... Why don't you just use the restroom there? See, like, they aren't even comfortable enough with each other to, like, use the restroom and take a shower in the same room. So, let's go ahead and serve dinner. We're gonna serve a taco casserole because I'm sure Alun is getting pretty hungry. And she's also a little bit tired, which is very sad. Maybe you should just look at your frog or something. She is so cute, you guys. Oh, wait. Oh, she's so sad because she really... She really just wants to take a nap, but there's no time for that right now. So we will probably put her to sleep. Maybe we will call a sitter and then we will go on a date. It is 6 p.m. on a Monday, so there's not too much going on. And I'm sure whatever we do, it'll be fantastic. She's kind of stinky. Oh, she had ice cream in her pocket. That's still good. Okay, uh, maybe we shouldn't let all the toddlers have ice cream all the time. But she's so angry because she really sees the restroom and Glenn's not doing anything. So let's actually read a loon to sleep so she gains some imagination skill. That's always good. And Katie, she's uncomfortable being around the toddler with a stinky diaper. But it like it's kind of y'all's responsibility to take care of her. So I'm sorry about that, but that's just the way it's gonna be. Let's drag some of these dishes to the sink because that's dirty. And let's see how Glenn reads a loon to sleep. They have maybe a pretty good bond. Let's look at their relationship. With Katie, it's all the way up. Oh, with Glenn, it's not at all. Ooh. It's just a little, little scary. But, you know, hopefully after the date, things will just be good. I hope. Katie, you can eat that. I know you're hungry. More choices. Open. Oh, we got some sack lunch and some ice cream. Let's just grab a serving of this. And I don't know what, what thing we're listening to. Why are we eating on the ground like this? <laughs> I'm confused. Like, wouldn't you want to sit down and eat? Why do you want to sit right here on the on the carpet and eat? That's just that's just weird. Oh, she's gonna go look at her picture. We even have a sitting area here, and she's still choosing to just stand and eat. It's weird. Okay, so anyway, Alun is now asleep. Glenn, he's holding a glass of water for some reason. And I know Katie's eating right now, but I think that we could probably send him on their date pretty soon here. His workout's complete. He's working 19 hours. And Katie, she works from home. She needs to get focused and she needs to have 150 social media follows, followers. So let's go ahead and social network. Let's update her social media status. And then we will go out on the town. So let's ask on date. It's going to be Glenn. He's in the household here with us. But... We still have to ask. Oh my gosh, she got brain freeze. That is so funny. So we're updating our social media status now. Let's see if we get any followers. We need to get focused. Oh, okay. So now that we have gained 15 no social media followers and we have 55, we are going to go ahead and ask Glenn out on a date. So here we are. Katie and Glenn have made it to their day already. What's with the attitude, Glenn? Calm down. Mangle, socialize with our date, and now we must request a table. So let's request a table. Glenn, he's going, is he going straight to the bar? To talk to the, the bar woman? Oh, no. What's with the deal? We're supposed to be on a date together. He better not be talking about me over here. Oh, man. Okay, so we're going to go to our table. Okay, good. Glenn is following. I was a little bit worried that he wouldn't because he's showing signs of just being strange and weird. Oh, it looks like Bjorn and Clara are out on a date too. Nice. Why is Glenn getting on his phone in the middle of the date? Oh my gosh, guys. I, 
I don't think there's anything going on good about Glenn. We're feeling pretty flirty though, so maybe let's funny tell a funny story. Wait, where are we going? And we can order for our table. Like so far, it's it's good. So far, it's good, guys. Okay, so here we are. We're ordering. Um, let's get a Simsapolitan for Katie and a Dim and Gusty for Glenn. And then for the appetizer, we don't want an appetizer. We're just going to go straight to... Wait, do they not have real food here? Oh, main course. I missed it. My eye just went right past it. Well, Katie's going to get the roast chicken. And Glenn can get the rack of lamb. And that'll be good so far. This is an expensive date. We don't have a lot of money. So I'm hoping that it goes well. Okay, so this, I guess, is our waiter. That's not the woman who sat us, but that's okay. Thank you. We'll bring out your order already. So now we're waiting for our food. What was that? The heart negative. We're just chatting. Um, okay, we'll just come back and we'll romance. We'll blow him a kiss. Because we still have to socialize with him. I don't know if those count as socializations. Let's make a funny face even. And a funny, uh, do an impression. I think Katie is using the restroom upstairs or she was going to and then I told her not to. I'm sorry, Katie. We can get through this dinner, I promise. It'll be fine. It'll be great. It'll be a good time. Oh, that's a funny interaction. This romantic dinner may have been a good idea after all. <laughs> funny. Make a funny face. Oh, our food is here. Now let's check it out. So Katie has the roast chicken and what looks like a margarita. And Glenn got what looks like could be like a coke. Coke and rub oh, what is that? And a rack of lamb. So it looks like they're both ready to dig in. But first, we need to talk about our meal. I don't know how we do that, though. So maybe we should just pack into sack lunch. I'll just take this to go myself. Don't worry, guys. I've got this. Can we talk about our meal? Complain about dish? I don't want to do that. Discuss food flavors. Enthuse about meal. I don't want to complain, so we're just going to discuss the flavors again. It's a good day so far, so that's good. I'm so glad. Katie's feeling really uncomfortable. Un uncomfortable. Katie's feeling really uncomfortable, so I might actually just send her home soon because she really has to use the restroom. So what we're going to do is we are going to end meal and pay because our hunger's doing okay. So we're just going to have to finish off with the silver date today because I don't want her to get too um, bothered by the dinner. So let's go ahead and get that finished up and then we can send Katie upstairs to use the restroom. I thought that there was an upstairs with a restroom. Is there a restroom here? Oh my gosh, Katie is like stinky and stuff. But Glenn is still flirting with her, so that's pretty good, I guess. She's like, hello, waiter, I would like to end my meal. All right, now where's the restroom in this place? Because Katie really has to go. She's walking like a little duck. Oh my gosh. This lady almost set the place on fire. Let's um go home. Some cannot go home right now. I guess we have to end the date. End it early. Nice date. There's some flowers in your Sims inventory. Awesome. So let's go ahead and send Katie and Glenn home for the night because it's been a long one. So now we are going to send Katie to take a shower and then she can go to sleep because I think Aluna's in a pretty good mood. Her fun is a little low, but honestly, like, what could she do about that? She can come play with some blocks, I think. So we'll stack those. Glenn just went straight to sleep. He must have just been tired. Now, guys, in the last episode, I asked you guys to make households, but I don't remember. Uh, did I make you hashtag them, Megan plays? I can't remember what the hashtag was for them. Oh, um, all. Oh, yes, I think that this was the hashtag so that you guys could make um, a little family that, you know, I could move in and have Elune become friends with. So this is really exciting. Um, I'm going to have to go through all of these and place some of the ones I really like. This is a nice family. What does this mean? I like the cowboy themed of this one. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to go through and I'm going to place some of these in the world and then we will be interacting with them next episode or maybe this episode probably the next episode because i have to go give them houses and stuff 
But this is awesome. Um, if you guys want to also enter some households in to be in this series, the hashtag is Megan Plays, or you can put Megan Plays with two N's. I'm going to be checking the Megan Plays. I'll probably check them both, though. Oh my gosh, it is now the next morning and Katie has time for work. So we are going to continue to work from home. We still have a few tasks. We need, to, we need to level up in the video game skill and be funny with five different sims, which we can easily do. And I think that Glenn also has worked today in six hours. Um, how is he doing? He has enough energy, I think, to probably get up and start his day. Because I know that Aloon needs some food and other stuff like that. Once Katie gets in the green, we will also be waking her up. More choices. Open. We will grab um, some food for a loon. I think that there's a fruit salad there, so he can easily grab a serving of this. What is he doing? Why is he swearing? I just don't understand why Glenn is so angry all the time, you guys. I really just don't. Oh gosh, and Bills came in and we can't afford them. Maybe that's why he's swearing. Oh no. So we are gonna have Katie wake up immediately. We are going to, more choices funny make funny faces and then we are going to tell a funny story to a loon um since that's kind of stuff that we need to do not only for a loon but for ourselves oh that is so cute so we're gonna tell a little bit of a funny story our comedy level reached level three so we are a pretty funny person we are gonna give a loon a bubble bath um and we need to keep on being funny we need to level up in the video game skill Things that I want to buy is we need to get Glenn maybe a workout station and we also need to um, buy a yoga mat because I would really love a yoga mat. Because some of you pointed out, even Zach pointed out, he was like, why is Glenn always on the computer? I was like, I don't know. It's like the only activity he can do. And he was like, no, he should be on a workout machine. I was like, that makes sense. <laughs> so we're still telling this funny story. Did it work out? We don't need to grab a bowl of ice cream, that's for sure. Oh, we should probably work on partying. Oh, <gasps> potty train a loon, and also the geek con is in town, so we're gonna go do that today. Stop eating ice cream, Katie. We need to potty train a loon, no. Grab her, she probably already used her, she didn't use her diaper yet. Come on, Katie's not even watching her. What's wrong, Katie? Maybe she's thinking about how her relationship is probably failing a little bit. Come on, a loon, use the restroom. You've been sitting here for a couple hours now. A couple sim hours, we're not gonna lie. There she goes. She went potty. It's really gross though. But we're still happy about it. And then we can give a bubble bath to a loon while Glenn. Oh, that doesn't even need cleaned. Glenn needs to go to sleep though, because he is work soon, so maybe a little nap would benefit him. Okay, so after we give Alun her bath, we are going to be heading off to the Geek Con to try to get some sort of video game experience and maybe we'll meet some new friends there too. We're also going to be taking Alun. I don't know what Alun can do there. Um, that's why I'm kind of excited for her to become a kid because right now it's like we're just doing a lot of <laughs> like potty training and stuff. All right, all clean. So now, Katie, no, no bed. We're going to head to the Geek Con because Glenn has to go to work so we can't take him. So Katie is over here on the Blink Block machine gaining some of that video game skill while feeling really playful. Alun is babbling to herself all the way over here. Alun, why don't you come over here and hang out with your mom for a bit? Just, um, go here. She's about to start making a mess, but I caught her. That should be worth parenting skills in itself whenever you catch your sim about to do something bad and exiting it out. Ultimate gaming test. We don't want to enter that because we'll probably lose miserably because we don't have any sort of video game skill. Our parenting skill is level 4, so we're actually doing really good in that. Ultimate gaming test. Maybe that will gain us some video game skill. And then we will play with a loon some because, you know, we're bringing her to this convention and she has to enjoy it too. Because we don't want her to just be alone. That'd be mean. But yes, we are now at the required level. Oh no, responsibility went down. Time to parent. More choices, parenting, um, discipline, recent behavior, firm, tell not to make a mess. Here we go. But, hey, Elune can now look at pictures in toddler books and play with others at the dollhouse. Come on, come on, parent her, Katie, parent her. All right, so our responsibility went up. Maybe our, our relationship went up too. Let's teach her to talk some, uh, hug lovingly, and more choices, uh, friendly. Play. We don't have to clean up this mess because uh, we don't own this lot, so luckily it's not making us clean it up. But here we are at the Geek Con, and it's it's kind of perfect because everyone's going to think that Aluna's in disguise here. 
So we're just gonna work on teaching her to talk and junk like that. Oh, it's happy hour at the karaoke bar. That's awesome. Order food. Aw. Give her a little hug. Aw, and now we're playing together. The convention looks like it's wrapping up though. Uh, so I'm glad that we were able to spend some quality time with a loon as well as get some of the video game skill but now it's probably about time to head home uh, we're ordering some food really fast though it appears luckily the booth hasn't closed yet what's what's wrong with the loon is she tired the loon is very cranky and very tired so we will be leaving after katie eats this hot dog because she is also very tired like danger zone tired so why don't you come sit could she not sit over here what is she gonna do Nap on ground? Okay, I guess. Let's just go home. But like, let's pick up, let's pick up a loon and go home. Cause I don't want to leave her. There we go. And we're off. Back at home now. It's been a pretty productive day. Why don't we have Katie update her social media status? Um, we didn't finish the stuff we needed to do for work, so we didn't really get paid. Um, and we're gonna have to be funny about five more times with five other sims before uh, we go to sleep because you know don't go to sleep more choices funny make funny faces don't go more choices funny funny faces oh no we're, we passed out from sleep exhaustion I didn't even hear that happen Glenn is still at work he comes home at 9 p.m. so in a couple hours it looks like he hopefully may get a promotion that'd be awesome because we really need some money to pay the bills for the day there we go. We're being funny because I'm trying to get this little extra piece of money. Oh, Katie was like, <laughs> Alun was like, do not talk to me right now. We're just trying to be funny. Katie's too miserable to be funny parenting. Um, let's teach her to say sorry because she was a little bit mean to us just now. Uh, okay, so we are going to, can we read Katie to sleep? I mean, read Alun to sleep. Look at me. I'm getting everything all mixed up. Let's just put to bed. Empathy is going down. I'm trying really hard just to... Oh my gosh, my relationship with her is getting very hurt right now. Katie, just walk away. Just walk away, Katie. Choose the restroom and go to sleep. Alun is feeling so angry she can come sleep over here by herself. I don't know what her deal is. I don't know why she's... Like, I don't know why she's acting like this. Like, she should have just went to sleep. She should have just went to sleep, you guys. Oh god, but she's hungry and tired now. So hopefully whenever she wakes up from her little nap, we're gonna get her some food. Um, like so, grab a serving. I will get her a high chair, guys, soon. Right now we just can't really afford it. Oh good, England did get a promotion, so now we can pay the bills. We barely have enough money for them though, so let's- Oh no, we can't! We still can't afford them. Oh man, it looks like we're gonna have to try to pay the bills tomorrow. <sighs> but guys, I think that's a great place to stop for the day. I am right now sending a loon to sleep. Same with Glenn. And then in the morning is where we will pick up in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, if you enjoyed it, don't forget to slap that like button and hit that subscribe button if you're new here. It would mean the world to me. All right, guys. I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>